You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures too. I played this game mm. was when we were in school. Huh? And since then, since then, I have never played this game. <laughs> no wonder you won. Yeah. yeah. Ah. When I'm come here every evening to relax. I see. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> and since I won, the strings are gonna be on you. No problem. <laughs> no problem. Ooh. All these times I have not seen you. That's right. Uh, how are things with you? The last time I saw you, you were frantically searching for a job. That was before I left for overseas. Yeah, that's right. So? Yeah. yeah. Ah, it's been long, hasn't it? Oh, Ooh. You see, I've come quite a long way from the job hunter that I was then. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. I now have a steel production and marketing company. Uh -huh. All on my own. Oh, God. <laughs> Ah, that's very impressive, you know. Yeah. Oh, damn well. Thank God. Damn well. <laughs> so, uh, if I may ask, have you got a family? Any, 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 any wife? Yeah. Well, <laughs> my family is blessed. Mm. See, my daughter just graduated from the university, mm -hmm. and my son is still in his third year. <laughs> Eh? That's right. Oh, that's good. Very impressive. You see, some of our friends are not actually making it. Mm -hmm. You see, so uh, seeing you as my good friend, making it, in fact, I should say I'm very proud of you. Oh, oh. <laughs> that's good to know. Yeah. That's good to know. Uh, so tell me, yeah. what about you? What have you been doing with yourself since then? I mean, any family? Oh yeah, uh, I can't complain. Uh, to borrow your own words, uh, <laughs> I've been blessed too. Okay. Uh, only that um, business is not like yours, <laughs> you know. But I have a son, but my wife is eight. Oh wow, uh, Anyway, any business that comes my way, I do it fast, slow, be it. Money is what matters. I what <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 I got what you mean. <laughs> Whatever goes right. Exactly. <laughs> Woo. Let's see. Let me give my card. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Why don't you call on me when you have time and we can arrange something? Ah. You know, dinner with the families perhaps. Oh, dinner? Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll give you a shout. Yeah, sure. Do that. Hey. hey. I see. Oh, boy. Take care of yourself, huh? Thank you. I'll see you later. I'll give you a shout. Talk to you later. Bye.
well, well, well. Long time no see you, oh, long. <laughs> Where well, have you been? Well, 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 I've been around. I've been around. I've been around. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so, how come it's taking you so long to drop by? I already lost hope of seeing you again. Oh. After I told my wife that uh, I met an old school friend of mine. Ah, your wife? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, the kind of business that I do, I don't sit at one place. Mm. I move around a lot. Because if you don't do it that way, the business uh, doesn't go right and the, the monies don't flow. So I'm always on the move, going up and down, you see. Mm -hmm. and, uh, in fact, my visit to you today is all about business. Oh, really? Yes. Tell me about it. Uh, yes, it's true. Um, uh, but before I should say anything, uh, I'd like to apologize for something that I did to you. Apologize? Yes. What about? Uh, I know you see, we've been good friends for a long time. And I know what you can do for me. And uh, I know very well that you wouldn't think this one so hard, you know, when I tell you this, you see. Um, I used the name of your company and the address as a font for this business that I have on the ground now. I see. I see. You see, uh, the whole thing is the business or the project I'm talking about now is a big one. Okay. Money involved is also huge money. Mm -hmm. So I thought uh, to make the whole thing look more viable, I used your company as a front to actualize the business. Well. So long as it doesn't harm the image of my company, I guess there's no problem. My friend, the image of your company will never ever be harmed. My business that I do is smooth and clean. And you just see how the monies will start rolling in. Money, you'll be surprised. In fact, I knew I could count on you. Uh, come on. <laughs> What are friends for? <laughs> so tell me, what is this business that brought you down here to come and see me? <laughs> you have actually hit the nail on the head. <laughs> you see, the whole thing is about the delegation of white men are coming from Holland. All because of this business I'm telling you mm. about. Uh, they are coming to finalize the transactions and they also sign some papers and after signing the papers they will release monies to us money is good business you know so that's where you come in i will need your help you know? mm. so what can i do very good um, you see i'll need your office okay. and then also some of your manufacturing companies you see so I'll take them around, mm -hmm. show them the places, so they can see for themselves how serious we are. Mm -hmm. You see, it will give the whole business transaction a proof of legitimacy. Mm -hmm. And that's it. Oh. Yes. And uh, if I may ask, how much is involved in this business actually? Oh, uh, my good friend. It's money. <laughs> How does $50 million sound to you? $50 million. Oh. I would say that is a business to be done. Oh! <laughs> How much is in it for me? Oh! Anyway, after considering so many things, um, I thought it wise to offer you 10%. Um, 10%? Yes. Uh, why don't you make it 30%? 
Remember, it's my company that is going to do all the work. And uh, if there's any problem, I'll oh, not... Scout Honor, I promise there wouldn't be any problem. The business that I do doesn't come with problems. Only. All that comes with it is money. Money. So uh, I can assure you, my business is smooth, pure, and simple. So, um, well, I have some one or two runnings to do. I'll be paying some boys on the ground doing some operations for me and things like that. So, um, okay, okay, okay. I'll give you the thirty percent. <laughs> no, we are in business. Ah. <laughs> you got yourself a deal, man. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Dropped by my office today. I can't guess, darling. Who did? Chief Jumbo. Remember? The one I told you was my best friend back in our school days. Oh! Uh -huh. That's what you met at the tennis club some months back. That's him. That's him. And guess what? what? He brought the sweetest kind of business proposal along my way today. What kind of business proposal did he come with? Well, I don't know. But I think he got some white men into believing he has some amount of steel to supply them. Mm. They will be in the country sometime next week. And he needs the use of my office as a front. If I may. At which I will get 30% of the transaction money. Darling, if I may ask. How much money is involved in this business? Uh, how will $50 million sound to you? $50 million? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sweetheart, that's a huge sum of money. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That thing sounds like 419 to me. Yeah, I, I guess that is what it is. But if you ask me, sounds white right, man, right? I mean, why must they always jump at an underhand way of making money? Eh? The way I see it, they know that it will cost them a whole lot more if they import this steel into their country through the right source. But this way, they have a chance to cut profit. But how would they know when your own friend has cleverly used a legitimate company? Your own company for that matter. Sweetheart. If you ask me, I will tell you not to get involved in this business. It doesn't seem right to me. Come on, come on. You women worry too much. This seems right to me. See, it is a profitable venture. Otherwise, Chief Jumbo wouldn't have gotten involved in the first place. What is surprising to me is that I don't know why you want to get yourself involved with this kind of money. We are satisfied with what God has given us. Why do you want to stain your hands with 419 money? Uh, this might get you into big trouble. Because please stop. Nobody in this world ever gets his feel of money. The more they make, the more they want to make. But darling, the, 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 No but, Ngozi. I did not tell you this so you would jinx it for me. As a matter of fact, I don't want to talk about it anymore. I suggest you get some sleep when you're ready. Good day. So I think you have agreed to all the terms here. Yeah. So it's time for you to sign the papers so that uh, we finalize the transactions. <laughs> do it, do it, do it. <laughs> Thank you. 
good. <laughs> That's lovely. Yeah? Thank you. Okay. 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 Good. <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is the beginning of a fruitful working relationship. I'm so happy. I'm so so happy. <laughs> Alright, let's get so much to celebrate. Thank you. So, Yes, How are you going so early this morning? Are you not going to have your breakfast before you? No, Dad. Nelson and I are having. Well, we're going around to look for an appropriate house for him. So the earlier we start off, the better. Oh, I see. Uh, but come home early for dinner. I'm expecting guests and uh, I'll need you around. Okay? Okay, that, that'll be fine. Yes. No problem. You take care of that. And we better careful to chase back. Think of all the places we've been to. This one has a big queue and the rooms are quite spacious, you know. Yeah. I kind of like this one. Think I should take it? Yeah, yeah, I'm cool with this. This is really good. Hmm? Oh boy, I beg, I beg, make up your mind. I'll leave you here, honestly. You'll be taking me up and down since. I have an appointment, man. I gotta go. I thought I was going to take you for a time with dinner and stuff like that. Me? No. Popsy is having people over for dinner, so... I gotta go there immediately. Anyone important? Mm, I don't know. I guess business partners or something. All right. Well, um, guess I'll take this one. Ah! Oh, thank God. Oh boy, I for you. I bet. Let's go meet the agent now, 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 please. Please, <laughs> please, please, come on, please. Just ignore him. 
you know, whenever he sees a PlayStation, he behaves like a child. One wouldn't even remember he's a university student. Choma. But I'm right. Why are you just talking like this? I quite agree with him. I am a PlayStation freak myself. Oh, yeah. okay. I guess I'm being outnumbered. I just better shut up. <laughs> <laughs> not really, not really. Ah. So, um, Chioma, that's then, yeah? Yeah. Um, what do you do? School or something? I graduated last year. While waiting for my youth service, I'm running a computer training program somewhere. So. Mm. What course did you study? Mass communication. Okay, that's good, I guess. You guess. No, don't get me wrong. What I mean is, I am a computer engineer, so I really don't know anything out of my field. Okay, apologies accepted. <laughs> uh, Uchena, what do you do? See? Yes. <laughs> oh, that's nice. That's computer cool. science. Yeah, that's nice. So, the food is ready. Food is served. Okay. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Please don't tell me you know it. Alright, do. <laughs> no, that's nice. This way, please. Remember that there is some balance. Who remembers you every day with or without your love? Even when life means nothing to you, when you think of you, there's no point living in this world of wickedness. Someone, somewhere, still cares for you. Remember me? Yes, I remember you, of course, but what I'm trying to remember is your name. Um, Kelvin. Oh, silly me. How could I forget? I'm so sorry. How yeah. could you have forgotten? Well, it happens sometimes. <laughs> anyway, I was just about to go buy something at the shop and um, I saw you. Oh, okay. Um, you know, this is where we have our computer classes, so we'll just finish the class and then we're waiting for a cab to take us oh, home. Really? Hello. My name is Olivia. Olivia? Chalmers' best friend. Just to let you introduce myself. My bad. I'm so sorry. Um, this is my incorrigible friend. Her name is Olivia. And Olivia, that's Kelvin. Olivia. Nice to meet you. How do you do? I'm good. And you? Fine. <laughs> so. so where are you girls headed? I could give you a ride. Uh, 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 well, not for me. I'm sure Choma is actually headed home, so... She could need a ride. I'm not sure he's going with me. See, I really hate to inconvenience you. Nonsense. Know. Inconvenience me. Come on. It would be an honor for me to have you in my car. Come on. Shall we? Okay. The pleasure is all mine, ma'am. Take care. Followed me. Oh, please, don't be silly. That's not true. Sometimes I wonder why. <laughs> why what? Why you don't seem to like me very much. Oh, God, Kelvin, that's not true. Oh. Okay. I. I like you. A lot. Okay. So, do you think maybe we could? Do lunch tomorrow. Why do I have this feeling that um, I've just fallen into some kind of trap? Oh, really? I'm not aware of that. Hey, trap. <laughs> <laughs> That's very funny. 
Okay, okay I think that's me, yes. Hmm? Okay. Okay. I'll do that. Ah, uh, okay. Just, just, just like that. Okay. That, you know what? I'll go out there and um, I'll scream later. <laughs> but I, prom what I promise you, you're gonna have fun tomorrow. It's not like if you just start shouting like it's very yes. Very amusing. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll be here tomorrow, eleven o'clock. I'll be waiting at the gate. And once it's twelve, I'll come in. How about that? You don't have to do that, but if it makes you happy, it's fine. Yeah. You make me glad. <laughs> Very glad. Okay, tomorrow then. Yeah, it was nice um, hanging out with you. Same here. You take care. Okay, um, thanks for the ride. Oh, my pleasure, my pleasure. Anytime. So, take care. All right. Bye. Come on, Jamal. Why don't you just come out straight with me? Look, I'm tired of this silence, this suspense. It's killing me. Please. What are you talking about? Come out with what? Such a hot girl. You owe me a gist. Or have you decided to keep it out of me? <laughs> Look, I didn't understand what you're talking about. Really, Olivia, I don't. Okay. Since you decided to become so childish, I'll just give you a little bit of hints. Can you remember a certain guy whose name starts with the alphabet K and N to the alphabet N? <laughs> the guy who gave me the ride the other day. Hold on a second. You're not talking about Kelvin, are you? Of course I'm talking about Kelvin. Look, Chama, I want to know the genesis and the revelation of that ride. Now. Nothing. Olivia, nothing. Really, truly, I'm telling you nothing. Okay, this guy just gave me a little. You don't need to make a love story out of something that is so simple and little. Okay, all right. Like you forgot that I was there, and I saw the little spark of interest in your eyes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just like you see a sparkle in the eyes of a rabbit. Whenever you're ready to do a matchmaking. No, no. Okay, come on. Let's be truthful with me. Don't you just like this guy like a little bit, like tiny? All right. I like him. A little. A lot. Huh. A lot? Yeah. <laughs> Olivia, it's still not enough for me to throw myself at him before he even declares his intentions. Oh, no, 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 babes. He will. Trust me. If you haven't trusted me ever in your life before, trust me now. He will. Mm. Definitely. I saw it coming. <laughs> yeah, you did see it coming. Yeah. You always do. You do. Yeah, call me whatever, but I know I saw it coming. Hello. Well, and you? Well, I, I can't say same for myself. Because I've been dying with anticipation since the dawn of the day. <sighs> of course now, today is going to be like my first time, I mean, going out on a date with you. First of many days to come, if I might add. <laughs> you know. Mm, well, I may just be as unbecoming as hell, and I hope you don't get so disappointed. Say, I was thinking, uh, could we make it dinner instead of lunch? I have been hankering to see what you look like at night. No, yes. Dinner will be just fine. Alright, I'm gonna pick you up at 7 o'clock then. Alright then, see you soon. Okay, I'll be waiting. Bye. Okay, no problem. Bye. <laughs> Father's place. 
talking about my house. I want it to look as simple as this. Yeah. You know, in my experience, it's always the rich who cry the most. You know what you should do? You should pick a nice young girl, nice, beautiful young girl. Marry her, settle down, and enjoy your father's money. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about nice girls. Was this girl I saw three days ago? My God, she is beautiful. Beautiful one. Um, well, it's always the beautiful ones that you go for. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but not my fault. Okay, no, not my fault. <laughs> not my fault. But anyway, this girl you're talking about, do I know? No, 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 no. She is actually my father's um, business partner's daughter. Honestly, she, my dad invited them over for, for dinner. And all through this day, I could not take my eyes off this girl. It was just mind blowing. That's the word. Your father's business partner's daughter? Kelvin, don't you think that's going a little bit too far? I mean, definitely you're going to dump this girl, and right? it's going to get messy considering the kind of business your father's into. No, 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 no. See, Chioma's father has been a friend of my dad's for a very long time. Okay? So, I don't think there's going to be any problems. Okay. So, you're thinking about a long-time relationship with a Hey, person? man, slow down! <laughs> I've not even dated the girl yet. <laughs> you what? No! Isn't that kind of too slow for you, Calvin? Oh, really? <laughs> Let's just say she's not the type you rush. Leave her, you take your time and play your cards well. And that's what I'm about to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's kind of good. Okay, well, happy loving to you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, let me get you this man. I bet bring up, bring up, bring up, bring up. I'm shaking the worry you now. If you see the vodka. Stop making me blush. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. Hi. Good evening, sir. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, Kelvin. How's your father? Very fine, thank you. He says it's good. Good. Good evening, Kelvin. Hello. Can I tag along with you people? You know, act as a chaperone or something? Oh, definitely not today. Oh. Maybe we'll just have to organize something like um, boys' night out. Oh. But definitely not today. Uh, you do look very beautiful. Oh, thank you. Are you set? Yeah. Okay. Do you excuse me, sir? Ma'am. Yeah. You two go and catch your phone. But just remember to bring her back by 10 p.m., Kelvin. Will do, sir. Come on, man. Yes, I do. It's really nice, you know. I'm impressed. Usually, I attribute restaurants with bad food. Nice decorations just to impress the public. Don't let the manager of this restaurant hear you. Otherwise, he'll commit suicide. <laughs> <laughs> no, that is true. Most of the restaurants are like that, but this one is different. Well, most of the other ones, you don't want to know. Don't you think you're being prejudiced about this thing? I mean, yeah, it's relative, really, to the kind of restaurant. Some good food, some bad food. Well, there's a possibility, I guess. So I take it you don't go out often? I did quite a lot of that in school. You know, right now I think I've had enough. I just realized that I, I prefer my quiet times, you know, hanging out on my own. Yeah. So that means uh, you don't have 
boyfriend? Did I say that? Oh, no, I'm just assuming that if you don't have a social life, then you don't have a boyfriend. Well, I guess I just wasn't ready for that. I tried it out at school, well, it didn't work, so. What, what happened? Nothing much. I guess we were just two children trying to play the games of adults. And at the end of the day, we just realized that we were not just compatible, so that's how it ended. So do you think you're old enough to play the adult game now? Because I'd like you to work it with me. Chima, I would, I would really like to be the next man in your life. Have you heard from Chief Jumbo after that business transaction with those white men? Uh, no. Last time I called him about it, he said the money hasn't gotten to him yet. But he will contact me as soon as he gets a response from them. And up till now he has not called? Well, I expect that is because he has not heard from them. Really, I can see that you have a lot of trust on that man. Ngozi. Jumbo and I are very good friends. Why shouldn't I trust him? Well, nothing really. It's just that people like him are not to be trusted. Hmm. Sweetheart, if I were to be in your shoes, I will throw friendship apart. I'll face the issue of this business with a fine tooth comb. <laughs> I'm sure that man is up to something. You women are always too suspicious for your own good. Well, we are created like that so as to make our husbands say things clearly. 419 is like a hit and run vehicle. The money comes in as soon as the hit is made. And not the other way around. Sweetheart, I want you to think about what we're talking about right now. All right, Ngozi. I've heard you. I promise I'll see Jumbo first thing tomorrow. You okay. better do. Because it will not be wise for them to get us out of our own share. Uh <laughs> Chief Jumbo, after that business transaction with those white men? Uh, no. Last time I called him about it. He said the money hasn't gotten to him yet. But he will contact me as soon as he gets a response from them. And up till now he has not called? Well, I expect that is because he has not heard from them. Really, I can see that you have a lot of trust on that man. Ngozi. Jumbo and I are very good friends. Why shouldn't I trust him? Well, nothing really. It's just that people like him are not to be trusted. Hmm. Sweetheart, if I were to be in your shoes, I will throw friendship apart. I'll face the issue of this business with a fine tooth comb. <laughs> I'm sure that man is up to something. You women are always too suspicious for your own good. Well, we are created like that so as to make our husbands say things clearly. 419 is like a hit and run vehicle. The money comes in as soon as the hit is made. And not the other way around. Sweetheart, I would want you to think about what we're talking about right now. All right, Ngozi. I've heard you. I promise I'll see Jumbo first thing tomorrow. You okay. better do. Because it will not be wise for them to get us out of our own share. <coughs> <laughs> but I thought you were all for. Let's not get involved. Please forget about it. Uh, but now that we are involved, <laughs> I have decided that I will sit and relax and enjoy the proceeds. Because it will be too bad, darling, if our share of the money is not given to us. Nothing like that is going to happen. I promise. Jumbo and I have come a long way for that to be an issue. Any new developments? <laughs>
Oh, yes, sir. We have just intercepted an email sent by the company in Holland to Chief Marker. Oh, really? And? Uh, they wrote to notify him that the money will be paid in tomorrow. Oh, yeah? Uh, into the new account with the new number? Oh, we made sure of that, sir. You did? Yes, Make sure you delete all messages in his email box because I don't want my friend to get to know about this. Okay. And secondly, to monitor his email box from now until further notice. You see, so that if there are some new mails coming in, we know exactly what to do. Yes, Chairman. I'll get uh, to do this. And one thing do you know that uh, you will be handsomely rewarded for this operation? Yes, sir, Chairman, I know. So I guess you know that I will need your absolute cooperation on this matter. I don't want anybody who is not involved in this deal to know about this. Okay? You can always come to me. Chairman, sir. Hello? Oh, yeah. Okay, let him come in. Yes. Oh. Oh, my chief. Don't oh. My good old friend. Yes, I have you good one. <laughs> I'm fine, sit down. <laughs> oh, what may I offer you? Uh, nothing, thank you. Oh, I see. So, this is a surprise visit, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, good. Yes, yes, Chief. Um, I came to inquire about the business contact we had with our friends in Holland. It's been over a month now, and you have not given me any feedback yet. I wonder why. My friend. You are supposed to know first. You shouldn't be asking me why. Have you forgotten that the business we did, we used your company's email address and name for the business. So if there are some new developments, you are supposed to know first, not me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I know that. But don't get me wrong. I'm only concerned as to their reason for not having contacted us yet. That's all. Anyway. Um, in fact, I just don't want to be pessimistic, um, but I'm beginning to think that uh, the whole deal didn't go through. In fact, it must have been busted. Busted? Yeah. I mean, as in, the, the, the white men discovered they were being duped? Uh, I'm afraid so. I'm afraid so. But how? Huh? Everything, I mean, all the plans were thorough, so well that there couldn't have been a loophole. But, well, it happens. That doesn't actually guarantee that this job will be, you know. In this our business, sometimes you lose, sometimes you win. And in this particular case, I think it's one of those jobs that you walk away you know, counting your losses. I mean, it happens. Oh, no. That's too bad. Yes, very bad. Very bad, very bad. Um, uh, anyway, you don't have to worry your head. Luck counts a lot in this business. But I believe that next time round, we shall be lucky and we shall hit it big. I hope you'll be interested. Oh, of course. Oh. Of course I will. Oh. Nobody in this world works at an opportunity of making easy money. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what I tell my boys. That when the opportunity knocks, you grab it. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, now let's get somewhere for lunch, wouldn't you? I have some brilliant ideas, very new ones that I want to discuss with you. Um, you'll be interested, I believe. Of course, I will. <laughs> no problem at all. <laughs> I'm free. Let's, Let's go. go. Yeah. <laughs> but although I hope I will benefit from this new idea of yours. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Run along now. Mm. I'll see you another time, okay? But this one, you're not coming to school tomorrow. I'll be so by myself. Look, I know. 
Well, you know, I just have some errands to run for my dad or else. You know, I always want to be in school. You know now. I know. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I'll survive. After all, we're not the Simon's twins, are we? Mm -hmm. <laughs> thank God. Oh, thank God you know we are not. Oh. <laughs> I nearly forgot. What? <laughs> Kelvin's best friend is having a party tomorrow in the evening. Really? Evening. So, well, I was just wondering if you would love to come. If I would like to come. Babes. Go for the party without me and see what happens to you. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I forgot you were a party freak. Of course, you know, I will go without you now, but you have to come early. Alright, don't worry, I'll come, I'll come. Take care of yourself. Alright, love, see ya. I'll call you. Be safe. Okay. Let's get into something. <laughs> Lock up the gates. Stop looking at me. Oh. I see, um, oh the man. Cool, cool, cool. I, I hope it wasn't difficult locating this place. Oh no, we managed just fine. Oh, that's my girl, that's my girl. Ah, uh, so why don't I get you girls, um, something? Drinks. Okay. Come with me. No, 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 no. You, you go with that one out. I'll, I'll take care of it. Oh, you're my girl. <laughs> you have fun, right? No, you have fun. You're from an island, girl. The way you're winding it for me, girl. Like, whoa. You're bumping and grinding in the club, like, whoa. I love to see you wind it in the club, like, Oh, I just wanna love you a long time, like My only mission is to make a you mine, like whoa. You're the sexiest girl in this party I'm so glad that I came to this party I'm about to get wasted in this party Yes Today? No, I can't, I can't make it today Well, that's because I'm only just being a lady Friday well, um, I have a lot of things to do on Friday, but I'll try as much as possible to sh to clear my schedule. Boy, if I don't, I'll still give you a call. Yeah. Okay. Bye then. Olivia. What? What in that? What? 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 Um, yeah. Why just put that smile on your face that made you look like some chessy or cat that's got some cream? Mm, it's love. Love? Yes, love. No, no, tell me, John. Uh, do you believe in love at first sight? Oh. Oh, oh. <sighs> look, okay, back to your question. Well, I don't know, but with that look on your face, I am very sure you already believe it exists. So now out with it. <laughs> well, yes, I believe it. That's only because I'm a victim of its existence. Oh! Now, this means that you have fallen in love with some guy. Yeah. And at first sight at that. Mmm. Uh, yeah. God, I can believe this. Okay. So, 
who is this guy? Well, let's make it more interesting. Why don't you guess? I fell in love with him the very first time I set my eyes on him. God, he's so handsome. You know, the, you know the most interesting bit of all of this? Is that he feels the same way too. He does. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Uh, how come I never saw all of this coming? <sighs> well, that's because you were so engrossed with your own affairs too. Now oh, look at you. I don't think I don't know that you're falling heads over here for Calvin. Well, <laughs> I'm not good at denying it. Okay? <laughs> wow, wow, what can I say? This is so interesting. It's such a coincidence. I mean, two best friends falling in love with two best friends. Wow, it's just mind blowing. I... God! Well, you know what, Joma? Call it coincidence. Call it whatever you wish to call it. I don't care. Babes, I'm so loving it. Oh, you are loving it. I can yeah. see that. It's, it's, it's mind blowing. I, I, my mind is. Oh my god, I'm so overjoyed. Oh, you are. I'm almost bursting with joy. Look at her. I can't believe this. I can see that. Anyways, it's all good. I wish you luck. At least now, I no longer have to feel guilty of mm. coming to each other. <laughs> Knowing that you also have your own somewhere, you know, it's not equalized. <laughs> I want to be happy and I want you to, you know, I've always wished for you to have this happiness you've always yearned for. You know, and now you have it. I'm I'm happy for you. <laughs> Kill, I'm happy for you. Come here. Oh. Oh. Well, that's so unbelievable. Why? You don't approve of him? No, no, no. No. The thing is, I mean, one would look at both of them and think they're not compatible, you know? Well, <laughs> anyway, that goes a long way to show that opposites actually do attract, isn't it? Nelson hmm. told me confidence is actually going to take her to the altar. You're joking. Wow! That, that, that's amazing. Okay. No, no, but your lips are sealed. Nobody knows about this. Sure. Okay, then I'll get to be the maid of one. Oh yeah, that's if I don't go to the altar before Nelson. Oh god, look at time. God, I have to get going before my parents return. Hmm, I know you must go home. So, how about it? <laughs> oh, please, be serious. Alright, you look alright. Except for the swollen lips that um, my mouth have done just this much.
Sơn Đạn hô gì đi I see. Uh, you're seeing quite a lot of her these days, isn't it? Oh, well, yeah. We're. Yeah, yes. We're friends. Friends? Well, I'll advise you to discontinue any association with her. Because I won't have it. Why, Dad? Um, is there a problem? Do I have to give you a reason before you do what I ask? Dad, I thought you and her father are friends, so why is there a problem with that? Oh, her father is my friend, but it doesn't mean that you should be a friend to his daughter. Look, I won't have it. Go out there, there are so many girls out there that you can fancy. Please discontinue this relationship. I will not have it. I won't. by the sea it was given to me by my grandmother. So what do you say? Mm. <laughs> that sounds really fascinating. But where am I supposed to tell my parents I'll be going for a whole weekend? Tell them the truth. You're joking. No, I mean, I feel you're no longer a baby. Your parents should know that. Well, sweetie, you will not understand. Trust me. <laughs> I don't think there's anything to understand or not understand. What I do know is, you know, you should let them know what's happening. Look, I know they're suspecting already. Maybe that's good because it's just a mere suspicion. You don't want to know. My parents are so old fashioned, you can't believe it. The minute they get to know for sure that we're actually seeing each other, they'll be expecting us to take it to the next level. Which is? I'm sure you know the next level I'm talking about. And, of course, you and I know that we are not ready for that, so... What's the news? Well, whatever it is, the most important thing is you following me next week to the cottage. And there we'll have a nice time, okay? Yeah? That's my problem. Uh, well, you know I wouldn't miss it for anything in the world. I prefer that smile on your face to that brown. Here. Yes, my baby. I needed a bit of fresh air, so I decided to come here. I hope no problem. No. <laughs> no, not really. Um, Mom, sister, there's something I wanted to ask of you. What is it, my dear? Uh, see, Olivia is down with malaria. Oh, my God. Yeah, and her mother called me yesterday. She was... Hoping I could come spend some time and take care of Olivia until she returns. Because she's traveling to Dubai. I see. So how long does she intend to stay at Dubai? Just uh, over the weekend. Mm. That's okay. You can go. After all, Olivia is your best friend. And you must be with her when she needed you most. Huh? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thanks, Mom. Thanks for understanding. You know. That's all right, my baby. Anything for my baby. Anytime <laughs> I go. You, <laughs> Thank you, Thank you. Okay, dear. Okay, let me just go ahead and go ahead with what I was doing. That's all right. Thanks. <laughs> and I'll <hope> you. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. I'll be back. And that you're cooking in the kitchen or that you've gone to the market. Of course, girlfriend, I have it all figured out. You know what? I've got you back. <laughs> Too flying. <laughs> anyway, thanks. I owe you one. Trust me. Of course you do. And you know what? When it's time for you to return the fever, you definitely will do that. Okay. I'm not. Oh, here it he comes. Come Hey, hi, ladies. Yeah. Olivia, how are you? Fine, thank you. Are you ready? Obviously. Good. Okay, let's go. All right, go. Take good care of my friend. Okay? Don't I always? <laughs> let's go. All right, take care. Have fun. You take care. My bag is downstairs. Just take care of it. Beautiful, huh? You know, when we were in school, we used to come here with my friends. You know what? We used to enjoy the peace and quiet. Oh, of course. If I had a place like this, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. This is something else. <laughs> oh no, you should see the inside, man. It's beautiful. I can imagine. I'm telling you, you're gonna have a time of your life. Woo! Look at this! <laughs> no problem. Yeah, I don't know what to do. Oh, hey, hey, come here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. Okay. Alright, you. Mm. Okay, now, first things first, we're gonna put up all the phones. Okay? Okay. So, why don't you relax? I can see you're tired, so. Sit down, because you need to be fit for tomorrow. And what is happening tomorrow? Tomorrow? Tomorrow, I will be, be giving you a treat. I'll be showing you how much I love you. <laughs> but I already know how much you love me, Kelvin. I know that. But I want to show you how much I love you, mademoiselle. Mm. Ah. Okay, rest, relax. What would you like to eat? Sorry, please. <laughs> oh, I'm fine. Just let me eat before coming here. No problem. Mm. Let's just put this here for now. This is nice, really. I mm -hmm. never knew places like I'm gonna give a treat of your life, baby. Remembers you 
with or without your love Even when life means nothing to you When you think and feel there's no point Living in this world of wickedness Someone, somewhere Still cares for you Such is love Ups and downs of life is not the end of time Such is love What you think of life is not what it seems to be Can somebody show me Wake up, sleepyhead. What time is it? What time is it? Okay, rule number one. In this Ooh. kingdom, there shall be no time watching. Mm -hmm. The only time we're going to have is sunrise and sunset. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's interesting. Okay, so what does one get to do in this timeless kingdom? Okay, um, it promises to be lots of fun. So what I have to do right now is go have a shower. We'll go downstairs for a cup of tea and then we we'll go sightseeing. Sightseeing? I love that. God, I can't wait now. Okay, so why don't you get a cup and go and have your shower. Meanwhile, I must tell you, <laughs> I, am, I'm, I am very, very good when it comes to helping people out um, when they shower. <laughs> You're a crook. Baby, I can help you. Don't worry, I can Believe handle. me, I am good. I'll be just fine. Honestly, I'll wash all the bites around. You're just a crook. I know. That's why I love you.
God, I can't believe how peaceful this place is. Gives you this feeling like you are at peace with the whole world. You know? Quite calm. Yeah, I call it my beloved paradise. Reminds me of you, you know? My Desiree. Mmm, Desiree. I like the sound of that. So tell me, what does it mean? Desiree means. No matter what. Hmm. I'd like to call you that name, that's if you allow me to. With you, I have a feeling I've never felt before. Honestly. And if you feel the same, I'd like us to make it permanent. I'm asking you to marry me. Calvin, babe. This is so sad. I don't know what to say. You just say yes. Say yes and make me the happiest man on the surface of this earth. Yes. yes I'll, I'll marry you. Oh. Yeah. you. made me the happiest man. I'll make you happy. Remember that there is some baby who remembers you every day. With or without you love. Go straight to the bank, gentlemen. Chief, you see, I am one of Chief Jumbo's boys. I'm sure you know who he is. I know who Jumbo is. He's my very good friend. I hope there's no problem. Well, I, I don't know how you see this. You see, I've been battling with my conscience because I know my telling you will be of great help to you if there is still a chance. Why are you speaking in riddles? What is it that you have to tell me? You see, Chief, I'm afraid your friendship Jumbo lied to you. You see, that deal with the white men did not defunct as it made you believe. What deal with white men? What are you talking about, young man? Come on, Chief. Come on. You don't have to play on me. I know everything. In fact, I was the one placed the money to your company's email box on any contact with the white man. You see, that contact came the very day you came to the office to see my chairman. See, I'm sorry, Chief. Your friend duped you. That same deal he told you yielded $2.7 million. Do you expect me to swallow this shit you are feeding me? Or are you telling me that Chief Jumbo, my friend, will do this to me? Well, Chief, believe it or not, that absolutely is not my problem. You see, the mistake you made... What deal with white men? What are you talking about, young man? Come on, Chief. You don't have to play on me. I know everything. In fact, I was the one placed the money to your company's email box on any contact with the white man. You see, that contact came the very day you came to the office to see my chairman. You see, I'm sorry, Chief. Your friend duped you. That same deal he told you you that $2.7 million. Do you expect me to swallow the shit you are feeding me? Or are you telling me that Chief Jumbo, my friend, will do this to me? Well, Chief, believe it or not, that absolutely is not my problem. You see, the mistake you made is having called Chief Jumbo, your friend, because he doesn't know the meaning of that word, friend. Well, I've actually come to warn you to find some cover because the EFCC is on us now. EF, EFCC? Yes. Uh, but how? Well, probably the white men notified the authorities. 
EFCC have been sent to investigate on the matter. I'm sure you know what that means, Chief. So long, Chief. So long. Well, goodbye, Chief. Chess ball for my game and people like you, bones like you, don't expect.